So, so far today we've made it to as high as 88 degrees and it's muggy out there, so it feels like the low 90s. Now tomorrow we're going to start in the upper 60s, but quickly warm into the upper 80s and low 90s for the air temperatures. Feels like temperatures for your Sunday likely to be in the mid 90s. So meteorological summer is here and it's for sure going to feel like it especially the second half of this weekend. Now let's talk about what's on satellite and radar. We don't have much going on over Arkansas. A couple storms down towards Texarkana and in uh, Tennessee, but we've been spared, which has been great. Great weather to get outside. Forecast track is showing that continuing as we head into Sunday. Here's Sunday morning, starting with mostly sunny skies. Now Sunday afternoon, I have a 0% chance for rain. Well, what I did is really just round down from about 10% because we could see one, two, three splodges of a quick downpour, but it won't last more than 10 or 20 minutes. So 0% chance rain, but like I said, I can't rule out a single little shower Sunday afternoon. Now Monday starting sunny again, but look what happens Monday afternoon. A little bit more substantial thunderstorms will form moving into western Arkansas. This is at 4 p.m. And then as we head into the evening, central Arkansas. Now don't take this literally, but Thunderstorm chance is definitely a little bit higher later in the day on Monday. Now it's felt like summer. A lot of the reason for that is because it's been so humid and it's going to continue to be hot and humid all day Sunday, Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday. But Wednesday is when a cold front is going to be moving through. Now extreme dew points before it gets here. After it gets here, it's going to drop off. But we know what that means. That clash of air masses is going to lead to some storms. So this is Tuesday. I think we'll see a couple storms maybe Tuesday afternoon, but like I said, Wednesday when that front gets into the state, more widespread thunderstorms, but there is some silver lining. Anytime we have storms behind it, we can see some drier and more comfortable air that will be here for Thursday and Friday of next work week. So that's the good news, even though we are tracking that risk for storms right now in a dash heating, cooling and plumbing tower camera. This is Mount Magazine and it looks muggy out there. You can see all the moisture in the air taking visibilities down a little bit. 68 degrees tonight for a low temperature tomorrow. 90 mostly sunny, hot and humid. Now here's that extended forecast. It shows summer like heat continuing through that cold front getting here. 94 on Tuesday, probably feeling closer to 100 degrees by Tuesday. So that's going to be the hottest day of the week. And then the front goes through, which will dry the air out, but it won't cool down much. Dew points and humidity will be low on Thursday, but temperatures still high. 95 on Thursday, cooling a little bit on Friday. And as we head into next.